It's also important to understand a little bit about an exciting topic that's growing, which is machine learning, you know, often used by a lot of data scientists today um, and just really, really cool stuff happening in the industry today around machine learning. And you just need to know about the different services that ultimately come into play um, that you might need to choose between. Uh, well, let's start with just Azure machine learning and what machine learning is to begin with. Well, machine learning, you know, by definition, yeah, by Microsoft is a data science technique that allows computers to use existing data to forecast future behaviors. Again, that data might come from one of these data services we talked about, uh, and then forecast future behaviors, outcomes, and trends. By using machine learning, computers learn without being explicitly programmed, and that's the big difference. And so there are two major services that Microsoft really wants you to understand. Uh, one is Azure Machine Learning Service, provides a cloud-based environment that you can use to prep data, train, test, deploy, and manage. So when you think of machine learning, that flow of prep data, train the model, test it, deploy it, and manage it uh, is really what comes into play, and then track your machine learning models that have been created. Uh, and it has a lot of automated machine learning and DevOps capabilities built into it. Now, if that's too much to handle and you don't want to sort of dive in at that level, uh, there's also Machine Learning Studio. Uh, and if we look at Machine Learning Studio, this is a visual drag and drop workspace where you can build, test, and deploy machine learning solutions without needing to write code. And so it's more of a wizard-based machine learning approach. It uses pre-built and pre-configured machine learning algorithms and data handling modules, as well as a proprietary compute platform. And so that's the core of it. That's all we're going to cover at this point for machine learning. Uh, but really the key here is no, when does machine learning studio come in? This is the more, you know, drag and drop visual workspace option uh, or Azure machine learning service. And that's more if you want to maybe a data scientist that really has models that you want to manage and train and prep, et cetera, based on that flow. Um, that would be the solution that you would look to for that.